bit loud. A bit of seal, I'll take it. I do like seal. Anyway, all right, I'm just putting on a bit of lipstick, you know. I'm about to film me try on and I want to impress you. <laughs> this is, okay, it's by Masorda. I think that's how you say it, all right. I'm not sure, but I think that's how you say it. It's the Bohemian one. Okay, this was from TK Maxx, £3.29, just about everywhere, £3.29. Okay, and this is in the shade Mimi, all right? Let me tell you, this is like velvet. Okay, you have to try this out. Honestly, get to TK Maxx, buy it online. Can you get it online? I don't know, I've not looked. I just know that I got this from TK Maxx and it's my favorite lipstick, all right? It is, it goes on like velvet. Honestly, it is beautiful. It is such a nice lipstick and it's pretty bottle as well and it's, you know, got the writing like down the side and stuff and honestly, it is so nice. My favourite lipstick. Okay. Dare I say ever. Probably not, but it's amazing. All right, it's amazing. I've just had to bin. Okay, I've just had to bin a really good... Well, it was my favourite lipstick. It was a MAC um matte lipstick it was discontinued years ago okay and i've had it in my collection i couldn't bear to like get rid of it but it needed it you know it had gone a bit a bit funky and i just thought you know what it is time and i was gutted because it was like it was like my first ever one of my first ever like proper bougie purchases do you know what i mean i just it was quite snazzy you know because max quite expensive so yeah that was a few years ago and I just had to get rid of it because, you know, I'm having to clear out and stuff and it's, I couldn't sell it on. It's like well out of date for me, do you know what I mean? So I can't really sell it on. But this, honestly, it is, it's amazing. So yeah, this is the um, Bohemian one. Honestly, I love it. So yeah, I thought I'd put a bit of slap on for you. <laughs> I was looking rough as arses, so I thought, right, Faye, come on, strong coffee and, you know, get your face on and get on with your shit. So I did just that today and I'm on almost 10,000 steps okay dog's been for a walk so you know massive I thought right you know what a massive walk <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this you know I like to tell you a load of shite before and and I about my day but um yeah I just took the dogs on a big walk got my steps in and you know I'm ready for the day now I feel good you know, I feel like I'm ready for the day. What I did want to ask actually right is one of my 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 feet I was gonna say one of my feet be right foot, all right. Twat is um. Oh, where, where am I going with this? What am I on about? Be right foot, okay, at the back. So just like at the back, the back of the bottom, you know, really hurts when I walk. Sometimes, not every time. Sometimes, and I feel like it. It's like it cramps up on a slur and I can't put like full weight on that foot and it drives me mad but it's literally like so say this is the back of me foot it's literally just the back of me foot it really hurts and I don't know why and it's just come out of nowhere it's really painful honestly it's pinching it now just having a bit of a you know a bit of a mingle and it's yeah it's honestly just pinching it really hurts but everywhere else is fine it's just that one you know and when I walk it's like it pulls, like if you was to, it feels like if I was to put full weight on it, it would snap. Do you know what I mean? Like, not snap, but in my head, how do I, like, if you imagine like loads of like guitar strings, <laughs> this face head, like loads of guitar strings and like, if you put full weight on it, they're just going to, do you know what I mean? <sighs> so yeah, anyone else get that? You know, that's what I'm getting at. Anyone else know what I mean? I don't know. It hurts, so yeah, not all the time, but anyway, that was a journey, wasn't it? I'm doing a try on today. So, my charity shop is charity shop keep or return. So, the things that I don't like, I'm actually going to return back to the charity shop. So, yeah, anything that is crap. I mean, I know these are going back. So, these are me, these are my jeans. So, yeah i don't know shall i keep or maybe it's just keep keep and store <laughs> not keep or return keep and store i don't know oh i need to burp there's a few bits from vintage in here as well not everything from vintage because you know things are in the wash and stuff so i can't do every single thing from vintage but the bits that i have got excuse me these are all the bits that i got last week so yeah let me get into it 
if you do want to stick around i really appreciate it if you like and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and um yeah we'll do a try on celine dion think twice is a karaoke jamming off i could i could i could honestly a couple of wines and i'll be on that karaoke singing think twice maybe i should think twice <laughs> empty the pub I got this top this was a pound see I got this from the Chazers last week dare I go charity shopping again this week I think I will this is a size has it got the labeling size medium so right let's try her on looks nice to the eye doesn't it the tits are here <laughs> I can't, I can't get it. Look, did you hear that? It's one of them. Squished everything. I can't breathe in it. It doesn't feel very nice. It doesn't look like I've got to lift. <laughs> got to lift my boobs up. Is. I mean, it's still. It's one of them. Do you ever get one of them tops where they absolutely fucking flatten you? they're so tight you cannot breathe that's how i feel it's very like look one of my favorite ever charity shop purchases right it was brand new and i didn't realize so yeah this was two pound 25 originally from primark so it's a size 16 originally 13 and they paid five on the reduced so it's just an absolutely gorgeous floaty skirt and i just couldn't leave it and i know it's not gonna fit i know because it's do you know what I mean? It's one of them and it's got a zip. Well, that's not happening. This is the zip. Ah, this is a zip. Ow. <laughs> I didn't realise, why right, these were QVC brand, Kim & Co. Honestly, these are gorgeous. They're such nice quality trousers. And these were a pound. They're stunning. Do you know what I mean? They're them type of... Oh, I love them, honestly. And I didn't know that they were quite a popular, well, a well-known brand on QVC. So yeah, Kim & Co. But these were only a quid, so I will chill for them. And it's my type of style. I mean, I hope they look all right. And I don't look like a right knob. Because I feel like... I mean, I love the material, but I feel like it's that material that probably isn't going to... Do you know what I mean? It's like a silky heavy it's very heavy material so yeah it's good quality but i hope it you know hope they look all right so yeah they were a pound these trousers honestly are stunning let me tell you they are gorgeous the material is gorgeous they're just don't ask me what i'm wearing with it by the way i thought this shirt might work and it doesn't so any advice any tips on what you'd wear it with i'm thinking like a graphic t-shirt but the only thing i don't like is the material is very clingy as you know i got this 2.99 my sports bra so this retails at 30 i got this off vintage so this isn't the charity shop but i got it off vintage for a bargain price so yeah i've not tried this on yet so yeah you know if you want to down the gym i wouldn't just wear this obviously this goes under like i mean i've got a chop a chop get your words out i've got a top from the charity shop that is pro no Pro Fitness, Pro, I don't know, LA Pro, something like that. I don't know. Can't remember now, but it's pink and I'm going to wear that over it and my leggings. So, yeah, when I go to the gym, you know, who is she? This I'm in love with, all right? Look what it's done. Honestly, I'm going to wear this all the time. Man. Fuck the gym. I'm going to have this on 24-7. You could imagine it, can't you? I'm a treadmill. Look, look at them go. <laughs> feel very secure honestly i just it's one of them where it's kind of like it flattens you again but i feel like it's doing bits this one's from vintage right originally new look it was a quid and i love it it's like a ready orange it looks more red but it's more orange if that makes sense so um do you know that's just reminded me all right traffic lights this morning okay they've put temporary ones up oh <laughs> near the school aren't they so both of them are red forever and I hate being the first because I'm like, do I make the move? Do I just go? You know, 
follow me everyone or like what if I go the opposite way I'm gonna go do you know what I mean like and they, they were broke they were on red forever <laughs> so I'm stood there thinking I've got a massive cube behind me I don't know what I'm gonna do do you know what I mean and eventually I just like thought fuck it and I went and you know everyone followed me I was like yes <sighs> I did it do you know what I mean and then the other people went so yeah they were broke because honestly I was there ages and ages and ages and ages you know, these temporary lights, but it's not the kind of road where, like, you know, there's mad traffic going, but, you know, I could, I could sense the frustration behind in the queue. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, I just went, they were broke. I think, anyway, I might have just fucking done a red light, I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, back to what I was saying. I love this because it's just, honestly, it's gorgeous. So I wore this the other day. It is quite a small crop top, but I wore this the other day with some high-waisted jeans and a black leather jacket. Went down the seafront, had a walk with Steve. He had a pint, I had a Coke. So it's got a bloody peg mark on it. But yeah, oh, and something else. What's that? But um, yeah, and I just felt really nice in it. You know what I mean? Quite summery, it was nice. So yeah, that was pound. As you know, I got this bodysuit. I haven't tried it on yet, so I'm going to try it on today. I love it. It's from, I saw it first, brand new. Um, off vintage though this was. So, yeah, it's got the tie shoulders, which I need because, you know, as I said yesterday, I can't get on very well with um, bodysuits because they just literally go right up there and I can't go with that. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I'm in love. All right, this is probably the first bodysuit. I've not even tampered with these yet. That has done up, if anything, like it's hanging. It's gave me extra, extra muff. Seriously, it's proper, do you know what I mean? That's the only complaint, like it's too long. You know, it's gonna get tangled up in all sorts. Of <laughs> tangled up in the forest, but I feel like comfortable. I can do all kinds of stuff. Seriously, like I can't, I can't do anything in bodysuits. This is up, like it's done up fully. If I could show you. <laughs> You don't want to see that, but it's done up, all right? It's... I feel great, honestly. Like, it's proper... I need to tighten these. Seriously, I need to tighten them. I love it, so... <coughs> choking on some here. Do you ever just get something at the back of your throat randomly? But yeah. Oh, my God. I need to tighten these, but I, I love this, so, yeah. Another Chazza special. Miele gear, trousers. Listen, all right, I like them. Pound, size 14, okay. We'll soon find out if they fit, but they were a quid, you know. Look at that with my sports bra, all right. Come on, the only thing is the pockets make me look wider than I am. Do you know what I mean? I mean, I can't blame, I can't blame the pockets entirely, but like they do stick out a bit, don't they? So, um. But honestly, you can just like picture it, can't you? Like me down the old uh, gym. Fucking treadmill ready, me. But yeah, they're not bad, you know. So this was from the charity shop last week. So this was from H&M. I think it's a size 16. I'm not too sure, but it's quite see-through. It's like a sheer um, meshy material. So, you know, with like um, a crop top or a, I don't know, you know, it's like a cover up on the beach or something like that. But yeah, I thought that was nice for a pound. So I like the pattern on it. It's quite floaty and, you know, you just can feel the breeze under the titty McVitties. That's a nice feeling when you take your bra off at the end of the day. <gasps> do you know what I do? I lay on my bed, right? Window wide open. I lay on my bed naked. <laughs> Airing it all out, honestly. Curtains closed, obviously, because... You know, I forget. I'm the type of person that will forget and just get right up. Do you know what I mean? But lay on the bed, air it all out. Honestly, legs like that and all. <laughs> just freeze a fucking bird, I tell you. Honestly, nothing better. I think I'm going to return this one. So I've just got it on with my bra. Um, they're quite, you know, similar colours. But I don't know. I'm, I'm just not feeling like the length of the sleeve. So, you know, it doesn't go full it kind of just goes like that and I just, uh, yeah, I don't like it. So I think I'm going to return this one, which is a shame because I did really like it. I do. I just, 
I don't think it suits me. I don't know, what do you think? I just, I feel a bit like, I don't know, like I'd wear like a black crop top under it or like I said, like a, you know, a bikini if I'm down the beach or something. But I just, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna return it, I think, so yeah. Got this dress, this was from Vinted, as I've shown you. So this is the maxi dress, it's like a rib knit um, maxi dress. Well, midi dress, it's a midi dress and this was a pound, size 16 from Primark and I love it. So I've yet to try that on, I'm gonna try it on in a minute. But I love dresses at the minute, you know, part of feeling free as a bird, I just, you know, whack a dress on and good to go, do you know what I mean? Listen, right, I finally have something that, dare I say, is too big. This, I love this. Okay, so this was pound off vintage, and I'm gonna keep it. I can't really see, but the split on it is where it's supposed to be, you know? And I just, I don't feel like big or anything, do you know what I mean? I just feel like really nice, and it fits nice, if anything, a little bit too big. You know, it's quite a, this is a size 16, or this is what I mean, okay? The sizing is all over the shop. I feel really nice, so. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Vinted again, so I love this. Like the beads, it's from Zara, and this was part of a bundle. I paid six quid for the bundle, so three quid each with two bits in it. And I just think it's really pretty, like with the beads. Like it's different, do you know what I mean? I've got hair, I'm trying to get the hair off it. But yeah, it's different, do you know what I mean? So, well, not like mad different, but, you know, just adds a bit of a, Bit of a shine, doesn't it? So yeah, love it. Honestly, it's quite a small crop. You know, it is quite a small one, but I don't mind it. With like high waisted jeans and stuff, I love the beads. Like, look at the beads. Like, they're really. Do you know what I mean? It's just different, and it feels nice and it fits nice. So yeah, this is a size large, and I do feel like very, very nice. Do you know what I mean? So I don't know whether like denim like light wash jeans or like a black pair. I don't know, all right? My fashion sense is just wear what the fuck I want and it don't always work, okay? It don't always work. But, you know, yeah, I really like this one. So bargain for three quid. This was the other thing that I got in the bundle. This is gorgeous, but a nightmare. Someone said, does a split go at the back? So if this is the front look, See, that's the label. No, look. It's there. At the front. Well, this is gorgeous, but like I said to you yesterday, it all hangs out. Alright, it, it's not one to wear in public. <laughs> For me, anyway. Then this boohoo dress, which is a maxi dress from Vintage, which was a quid. So, yeah. You know, just another dress that Faye don't need because there's a reason this doesn't shut. Like, honestly, it's chaotic in there. Like, you know I mean? <laughs> Try to shut it now. It's mental in there. I'm keeping this. This is a maxi dress from Boohoo. This cost me a quid, all right? And I always just, I feel great in like maxi dress type dresses. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's so floaty. Like, it doesn't cling to your, it's given me a bit of, do you know what I mean? It's really like showing off my hourglass and <laughs> I'm joking. These types of dresses always make me feel nice. Like they're really floaty and long. And Steve's just come upstairs and said he's gonna help me um, like sort out a setup here so you can see things full length because my try-ons are terrible and I've just been moaning. So bear with me, you know, the try-ons hopefully will, I'll sort some out, hopefully. That's the end of the video, hope you enjoyed it. I'd really appreciate it if you left a like and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. Like it would mean a lot. And if you could share my content if you want to, follow me on Instagram, it's fayj202. Um, I'm doing a giveaway which ends this week, by the end of the week. Pop all details in my description box if you know you did want to check it out and whatnot. So yeah, that's it. I love you and leave you, all right? As always, don't let any dickheads get you down, okay? Just know your worth, know how amazing you are. I hope you have a banging week, all right? Absolutely fucking banging week, because you deserve it, okay? You deserve it and happiness and everything, all right? You deserve the world, all right? You're just amazing, okay? Know your worth. I love you, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video.